Uh, can you be any closer? <laughs> what are you doing? I'm trying to get ready, but I have this baby in my hands here. Oh, whose fault is that? Anyway, happy Friday. Happy Good Friday. I think we got that baby because we made out. Maybe what? Anyway, baby's off today, so... In true babe fashion, <clears throat> we're going out to town. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Because he can <clears throat> never stay at home. That's okay. This means that tomorrow, Saturday, we won't be doing anything. anything. Correct? Correct. Did you even drink any of your dirty chai? It's not a dirty chai. And I just, I drank some of it, but I have to take care of the baby as well. I can't hold the camera and the baby and drink my chai. Girl, you better so, get a hold of your baby daddy. You need to get, get a hold of your baby daddy. You need to get your life together. You better get a hold of your baby daddy. Whatever. <laughs> Oscar Riley. Oscar Riley. What are you doing? People miss you. They say they miss seeing Oscar. You have to give them hello. You have to tell them hello. Oscar Riley. Oscar Riley. <laughs> You officially don't fool with me. <laughs> You're not even looking up That's to funny. listen to me. Well, there you have it. Oscar's over us. I am giving Chad the task of getting Mr. Man together all by himself. Daddy gonna get you together all by himself and Mommy's gonna take a shower. What's well, just a stupid onesie? That's why I said you gotta make sure he has pants, babe. But tell me that ain't slick. He can't be out with yeah, his goods out like cool. that. I wonder if that's going to be too big. It's cute. So it's zero to six months. It might be too big. It too big for you. <laughs> uh, yes. Is that too big for you? <laughs> Say, Dad, I probably need a couple more months before I can fit that. Is that too big for you? That. <laughs> Is that too big for you? <gasps> what are you doing? Well, dang. Back to the drawing board, babe. But I'm about to get in the shower, so I can't watch him while you do that. <laughs> it's daddy's turn mama gonna take her a nice hot shower and I look forward to seeing my baby all ready when I get out don't take all the hot water I'm not gonna take all the hot water <laughs> good luck sweetheart you're gonna need it <laughs> oh, well, we're gonna have this hand I'm gonna have him dress in probably about 10 minutes Everything done. About 10 minutes. That outfit is so sick. <laughs> <laughs> right? They come off. Well, too, I just said, babe, they don't stay out. they're too big. But <laughs> tell me if they didn't fit, they wouldn't be tight, though. Right? You're so cute, honey. <laughs> tell me, Seriously. Tell me that ain't cool on it, though. I mean, it would be really cute if they fit. I Daddy did a good job. Right. So, Dad, what you got all of this stuff up by my head? <laughs> <laughs> Dirty diapers. And, <laughs> see? <laughs> That's hilarious. Good job, babe. I'm proud the of socks you. Are good. I'm proud of you, sweetheart. Mm, the socks are questionable. Babe, but. you tell me what's the buddy sock in there. <laughs> I know we don't really have any brown socks. Did you have fun with Dad? Did Dad get you ready? Did he get you ready? Yeah. Say, so, Mommy, smell me. Let me do the smell. Sniff test. Mmm. You smell good, baby. Yes, you do. You yes, smell you do. good. Yes, you do. You use this? Yeah. You're so funny. And that? Yeah, just the ointment on his face. Yeah, but you, why you didn't use the lotion that matches the ointment? Because I like the mixture of the two. <laughs> I like I like a little bit of I like a little bit of Frankenstein and myrrh <laughs> Frank and avocado frankincense and avocado and shea butter shea butter and frankincense so some Frankenstein and some shea butter <laughs> with some avocado on the side <laughs> you're so weird no right I'm proud of you babe good you got job some Frankenstein and some avocado babe did a really good job. And, well, I'm not going to say he did it in less time than I would have. Because <laughs> uh, I done had a whole shower. I'm dressed pretty much and everything. So they, they had fun and they took their time. Good job, babe. You're going to have to do this more often. That was fun. Now you know what you're doing. So the baby's ready, but he's sleeping. So babe and I are going to record. We're going to try and record a video real quick. I've been getting this um, subscription box called nature box and 
I'm like a subscription box junkie. So I want to do like a taste test with Babe and just let you guys know about it. So look out for that video, which may be up before this one probably. And so I'll put the link down below. But yeah, we're about to film this video before the baby wakes up. You did so good, baby. Mom is so proud of the baby. So proud of the baby. We got our video recorded and he started off a little fussy. And then we had to feed him and <laughs> put him in a swing. But then we got to finish the video. So when y'all see it, he's only going to be in the first part. But Mom is so proud of him because him was in his swing just to chilling. Wouldn't you? Wouldn't you? <laughs> you ready to get on the road, baby? Getting on the road. Oh, face, you ready for us to get on the road? <laughs> no, because then you have to go in your crate. Huh? Him got to go in him crate. Him going to go in his crate. What up? She's driving. Let me turning down my music. <laughs> yeah, I wanted y'all to know I was listening to Alicia James. I can't hear you. <laughs> anyway, I'm listening to Alicia James, y'all. You know, fellow YouTuber. I thought that I had bought her album and I was looking for it the other day and I realized I never bought it. I just bought this, a single, I think. So, it's really good. Check out Alicia James. Shout out to Alicia James. Shout out. I don't know who you are, but shout out. I know. She's... Um, hold on just a second. Yeah, we at McDonald's. This is going to be our last bad meal. And that is it. 843 first one, please. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I'm glad you pay attention to the curve. What? I'm glad you pay attention to the curve. Honey, you got to school me on driving. I've been I've doing seen, this for years. I haven't seen, I've seen so many people hit that curve. Honey. I'm extra cautious with this car okay, anyway good. because it's bigger, so, so you curb I'm like rims, exaggerated. Problem. Honey, this is my car too. It's our car. I'm going to take care of it just like you take care of it. Oh, and we have a name. We have a name. Drum roll, please. <laughs> Jack! Jack! <laughs> At first I thought it was corny, right? And then babe was like i think i am gonna go with the theme of titanic we got we gotta keep the theme we'll keep we, the theme, we got rid of rose and we got jack yeah we need somebody a little bit stronger rose was cool but she just wasn't she wasn't very strong no so What's the she was i miss rose <laughs> oh you're so stupid rose. how did i know that that was funny? Uh, okay you got the money honey oh what sure you doing? of course i got the oh money. and somebody asked us Someone asked, I guess, how we picked, and I'm not really sure if you asked, we're asking how we picked the names of our cars or how we actually picked our cars. Um, so, how did you pick Rose? Actually, I picked the She name picked Rose, because I didn't really have a name yet, and... I named all my cars, and I was like, what's the name of your car? Yeah, I actually didn't have a name yet. I was like, I don't know, and she's, and I, I love Titanic. I'm man enough to say I love Titanic. And so she's like, "What about, what about Rose?" Like, perfect. Yeah, it, it so, actually fit perfect. So Rose was her name, and then, well, you gotta go with the other main character, Jack. <laughs> so here we go. How are. did you? So I don't know if you meant the names or how we actually picked the car. So how did you pick Rose as your car? Just because I want to cover, I don't know which part of the oh, question you meant. So. Man, I was just, uh, it was actually here in, in uh, you know, where we live. I was just like, it was before, um, was before Disney World. Mm -hmm. Before the Disney World trip in 2010. I got back from overseas and I was like. Was it before Disney World? Mm -hmm. I got it right before Disney. Mm -hmm. I was like, a, or right after, one of the two. I think it might have been right after. Maybe it was right after. But it was, you know, I was just like, man. I, I didn't know anything about that. I really want, you know. I really want you know something and I wasn't I wasn't sure if I was gonna buy anything but I just saw it sitting in the in the car lot and they were they had a super good deal on it so I just you know I always loved infinity so I was like I'm getting that thank you thank you, thank you. okay thank you but uh, yeah so that's it so I drove test drove her and then fell in love fell in love so Gigi is very simple. I'm very simple with the names of my cars. 
uh, I'm practical. This one, no. The the color of the car is standard factory color is galaxy gray. So that's why she's Gigi. That's she's Gigi. Um, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> thank you so day. much. Make sure they didn't dip us. Can I get some? Can I get some ketchup, please? Yes. And some napkins. He gave you some ketchup. He gave me for real ketchup. I'm talking about thank thank you, man. They never give that much ketchup. I was about to talk. Uh, the young I'm about to talk crazy, but the young kid. if he would have gave me two packets, I'd have been mad about that. So, yeah, so I'm very practical with my cars. My very first car was a Chevy Corsica, and it was blue, and her name was CC Blue. <laughs> she is. Yes. <laughs> and then my second car was a Ford Focus, and the color of the car was triple platinum. So her name was TP. TP2, because. R. Kelly's the TP2 that came out, but it was TP. And then, uh, then we've got Gigi. And I actually, what happened was I totaled my Focus. I absolutely hated that car anyway. I was glad the accident happened, but <laughs> ain't that horrible? I hated that Seriously? car. I was so grateful that I, grateful for that accident because I hated that car, but it totaled up because it's a cheap car. Ford makes cheap cars, in my opinion. <laughs> and uh, no offense if you drive a Ford. Dang, she went at it. Uh, <laughs> she went at it. And, um, She's probably gonna flick off the Ford dealership when we drive by, too. <laughs> And I was just trying to figure out like what car to get because you know they paid off my Ford and I was like okay now I need to get a whole nother car what am I gonna get and I was completely against Hondas I had this thing against Hondas for whatever reason because I thought everybody had a Civic and I was like I don't want no Civic I don't want no Civic now she loves her Civic. so then I went to the dealership because a friend of mine was like just go drive it and 2006 is when they first had the new body style from like the older Civics and I test drove it and fell in love and I'm still in love to this day I love Gigi that's why I drive Jack all day I, which I'm cool with yeah I mean cuz I, I still love driving Gigi don't get me wrong I'm gonna be I'm gonna be driving Jack now too if we you know ever go anywhere but, you be driving but we Jack. don't go nowhere <laughs> so long story short I want to introduce you to black Jack I black, black Jack. Jack his name is Jack though but he is black so we're finally on our way to freaking Florence. We've probably been talking for 18 hours now. Yeah, going to Florence. We're going to go do some shopping. Shopping. Shopping, shopping at the big Grocery Publix. Grocery shopping. The yeah, big Publix. The Publix. Because we are starting clean eating. Don't mind the McDonald's. I know. This is our last bad meal. Last bad meal, right? Last bad meal. Right. Even if we eat in, in, in Florence, we're going to get something good. Yeah, so this is our last bad meal day, actually. <laughs> last bad meal day. First step, stop. It's Best Buy, and we're standing here at the Geek Squad, and there are like no geeks. Like, where are they? Like, nobody's here. And where there's are the a geeks? line of people. Like, all these people are waiting. And as you can see, there's nobody back behind in that joint. Like, slim pickings back here. <laughs> Babe's having issues with his new PC, so we'll see what they do. They better fix it. <laughs> I can't with him. We're about to go walk around. Ain't that right, baby? Deuces. So we're gonna walk around. We don't know what we're looking for, though. I kind of need some new headphones. Oh, you know what? Let me see if they have our camera. I get a lot of questions about what camera we use. And it's the Sony, what is it? HX30V. That's the camera that we use for vlogging. Um, let me see if they got it here and I'll show it to you. I don't see it. Actually. They don't have it. Ooh, missing a lot of stuff over here, ain't they? Well, I can't find it. Okay, so now I'm looking at the Beach by Dre because we all know that they're hyped up. But I'm trying to figure out, are they worth the hype? Like, we have Beats Studio and then there's Beats Solo. I don't really know the difference. These joints are almost $300, Beats Studio versus Beats Solo. 
which are $1.99. So my question is, does anybody own Beats by Dre headphones? Are they worth the money? What do you think about them? If you own a better headphone, tell me, because I need some good quality headphones for when I'm editing and, you know, just when I'm out and that are not earbuds, like actual headphones is what I need. So let me know your thoughts, please. We're in the mall now. Um, in Dillard's actually and it's funny because I came to change Chad but when I went into the restroom there was already a lady using the changing table so um, big Chad as I say so Chad took uh, he went and looked in the bathroom and there was a male there was a changing table in the male's bathroom which is something nice I didn't know that they did that which I mean is a good thing because dads take care of babies too but it was funny I'm standing outside of the women's restroom and this uh, lady well, she saw us when we like rolled up to the restroom and she went in before I did. So she came out and she came around and looked in the car seat like, I want to see the baby. And I'm like, oh, he's, he's getting changed right now. And she stopped and she looked at me and she said, you, you're not doing it? Uh, and I'm like, no, his father is doing it. And, and she just kind of looked and she was like, oh, okay. I was like, it was full in the woman's restroom, so his father is doing it. But why did I have to explain that to that lady? She really like stopped and looked like she didn't get it. Like, well, you're not changing him? Do you see a baby? Uh, <laughs> people, I just think it's funny. People ask the strangest questions. It's like they don't think before they start talking. Really, really interesting. I'm gonna have to tell babe about it when he comes out. They've been in there for a minute. I hope they're okay. <laughs> this is, I think this is his first time changing him out in public. <laughs> How'd it go, Dad? Doing great. Good. We smile. Ain't talking about, talking about where we're at. When you change them? Change them. We smile and laugh. I've been trying to find some new workout shoes. I've been to two different shoe stores and I'm not having any luck. Like, they don't have my size. This is like a sign. Maybe this means that I just don't need no new shoes. But I, I do need some because my workout shoes are too big. I mean, too small. Like, they're tight around my ankle. <sighs> it's frustrating when you go and you can't find your size. Like, seriously? I mean, and I'm looking at multiple shoes. Like, five or six per store. And none of them have my size. Where are they doing that? Are they not? That is not a good look for the kid. Meanwhile, little man is fighting sleep. Fighting sleep. Fighting, fighting, fighting. I like this one. That's a small. Let's see the medium. So I found these shoes. You like them? I don't. I don't know if I like this color. You like it? I like it, but I don't know about that color. It's a little out there. You're so funny. Why is it so difficult? Because you're you. Whatever. Well, the medium. Not too bad. Not too bad? What do you think? I mean, it feels like it. It's a little more breathable. A little bit more breathable? Do you feel constricted in the other one? Ooh, not a ton, but a little bit, though. What do you think? I think it looks too big in the sleeve area. But that's my personal opinion. You don't want to wear it. <sighs> Do I like these shoes, y'all? See, the thing is, if I get shoes that color, I feel like now all of my outfits have to match that shoe. Like, I can't be just throwing on a purple shirt or... See, ain't that crazy? I don't need to be worried about that. But I am, which is a problem. So Dick's was a bust. <laughs> No North Face, no tennis shoes, no nothing. Although I did find a sports bra. All right. Now we're in Sam's though. I honestly don't know what we came to Sam's for, do you? Yeah, yeah. Diapers and wipes. Oh, diapers and wipes. I forgot. That's not the right size, though. That's not the same one. Oh, those are cruisers. <clears throat> Let's go down the pamper aisle. The pamper aisle. Now, it's been so long since I've been in it's Sam's, for real, to shop. You know? What? You got the car? Okay, let's see. So natural care? Yeah, natural care works. Okay. 
Oh, no, that's a good deal. Uh huh. 18 bucks for 800 wipes. Can't beat that. No, you can't beat that at all. I don't know why we haven't been coming here for his stuff. You always forget. Oh, the diaper genie stuff. How much of those compared to Target? <coughs> did that, I'm sorry, did I say $90 on this? Oh, I was about to no. say. That's not cheap. It's cheaper than Walmart for the pack. That's interesting. Guess you can't say well, on everything. Like for, this was for like a nine pack or something. It's there. only three in there. Three, three counts. Huh? Let's see. Might not be much of a discount on those. Campers, swaddlers. Here we go. So yeah, he definitely need to be in two. It says 12 to 18 pounds. For the twos. Oh wow. <laughs> He's still in the ones. And I was like, I think these are a little too tight for him. So now we're buying twos. Oh really? Look at that. Oh, wow. Hey, that's a good deal. That's a really good deal. Yeah, it is. So we'll take get, it. We I was just about to say, we might need to get two. What was that size my dad bought? Was it 180? Because it, it's been what, two, three bigger. weeks? Yeah, it's bigger. And we've gone through that pretty much. He's, he's only 14, so he's got three more pounds to gain. Yeah, we should, might as well just get two. What you think? Mm -hmm. Now you don't know. I don't know. You're just trying to... Well, I mean, we know where Sam's Club is. Let's just start with the one. Yeah, I gotta come back any, <laughs> next weekend anyway. Oh, that's right. To pick up his computer because we dropped it off at the Geek Squad. <clears throat> so, we'll see how it's looking. Okay, so. What else should we get? I don't even know, like, I don't even know, like, how to buy in bulk because I never shop at Sam's Club. Kleenexes. Kleenexes is good. <clears throat> trying to think of things that we use a lot that we need to buy in bulk like this. Not really sure. Dinner time. Guess where we are. I don't know what babe is over there doing. Look good? We got the same thing, but he got it minus tomatoes, obviously. Red lobster. It's going down, you guys. Babe got some kind of brownie situation for dessert. We, normally, we never get dessert, as you guys know. <laughs> but it was a good deal. <laughs> no, we never get dessert. We don't. We have a, we, when is the last time we got dessert? And we're out. Tell us the last time in a video that we, well, we had a dessert. dessert at a restaurant. I guarantee that's not... Hmm. Yeah. No, I'm thinking. Mm -hmm. When was the last time we got dessert? Now, if it's last week, I feel stupid. But no, because we didn't get a lot. We didn't get we any get dessert at CPK. Hmm? We had dessert at the house on Sunday. Oh no, not Sunday, but that Saturday when we were in Indianapolis, we had those brownies. We had those blondies. Remember when you went to Applebee's to get the blondies? I didn't count. At an actual restaurant. <coughs> well, because that was time. all we ate. We just went and got those. True. That's my actual. We ate dinner at the restaurant and anyway. That's true. Is it good? It is. It is. I got. It um, what is this? Caramel cheesecake. Caramel cheesecake. Caramel cheesecake. Take a bite of yours. Yeah. Let's see. Good? Can I take it? No, I'm good. Good. I haven't yeah. had cheesecake in a long time. It's my face. Somebody decided to wake up. Did you sleep good, baby? Did you sleep good, little yes, man? Yes. Say yes, man. With your long blink. I'm not quite ready to get up. <laughs> we had a good day. We didn't get to do everything that we went to Florence for. Like grocery shop. We were going to go and grocery shop at the Publix. And we did everything but that today. So I guess we'll be doing that tomorrow. I don't know. We'll see. But that's the end of the night. So we'll talk to you guys later. Good night. Deuces. <laughs> you have not seen the half.
first thing he says is, is this an amusement park? <laughs> I'm like, where's the rides at? We're not even upstairs Where's yet. the rides at? Where's man? the rides? <laughs> so funny.